What's up, people? It's your girl, Karina, aka I of Karina. Welcome back to my channel. And I am continuing my Lilith series. And in this video, we are going to discuss Lilith and Libra. So, do you have a Lilith and Libra or know someone who does? Then this video is for you. Okay, so first let's go over Lilith. Lilith is an energy that has to do with feeling like we've been set aside and outcast pushed out of acceptance in some area of our life and what ends up happening is that this energy is hidden it is very deep and dark and it is not always seen by everybody right but there are certain situations that trigger the energy and there's certain situations that you'll see it play out and that is where you'll find the zodiac and the house placements, right? So with Lilith and Libra, we're dealing with the Libran energies of feeling forsaken. So Libra is ruled by Venus, but is an air sign and is a cardinal sign, right? Air being that it's a communicative sign, cardinal being that it's like initiative and ruled by Venus means that it's about beauty and love and partnerships. So what happens here is that we can have situations where the darker energy of Libra is being played out through the, the avenue of being forsaken, which means that you might have somebody who early in their life um, had a relationship, maybe with their parent or with a friend, or maybe even early romance, and they felt forsaken or they felt unjustly treated. And so this specific relationship begins to play out for them continuously in life. It is almost like a foundation of their torment. And so there is a constant battle of dealing with the insecurity that was seeded and grown in this early relationship that may have even um, crossed over into abusive. So this early relationship being ruled by Venus, right, in a Lilith Venus energy means that you may have been hounded um, through communication, chattiness, gossip, um, direct arguments over your beauty and how like beautiful that you might feel so this could be about you know a feature on your body your face your eyes your skin it could be your actual body so like maybe your weight or maybe like not having the right shape or anything like that the Lilith and Libra becomes so painfully hurt by dealing with not feeling like they are beautiful enough. And so they have some issues and weird relationships with the beauty products and the materials that women need to be beautiful, right? And so sometimes this can feel like you're shallow in a very chaotic way because you are so crippled by not feeling beautiful and it doesn't feel like a real problem to have sometimes in life right but it shows up very clearly in your future relationships and so you might be dealing with a situation where your partner is looking at somebody else or or you know has a wandering eye or you know admires other women and or men and you are completely crippled to the point that you don't even know if you want to be with them anymore or you are just so hurt, right? Um, it hurts for way further than anybody could imagine that it would. And there begins the chaotic uh, seed of you first approaching the relationship in such a charming way and now they have hit a, a part in you that is so painful that all kinds of chaos starts to ensue as you are in this relationship and it's all based off of some of these beginning experiences that you had that crossed the line right so very often relationships are turbulent and it is not the end all be all but you will find yourself in certain situations especially in lower manifestations of love where you're with people who are reflecting your insecurities tremendously 
and they might be like interested in other people. So you might be with somebody who's still got a contract or an agreement, still married, still has a promise or has a tie to an ex or somebody that, you know, they love before they might still have feelings for. You may find yourself in these kinds of situations. Um, you're dealing with this pain and you might want to actually kill relationships altogether. You might be the might be like the kind of person that is curious about why relationships break up or look for why certain people do certain things in relationships that have to do with like cheating or being interested in other people and you're curious like you're looking at that you're looking for the answer in that Overall, you're also somebody who is the justice dealer. And so in any relationship, romantic or not, you are seeing equality unfairly used and then you are going to be the one to deal out the justice. And this can sometimes lead to other relationships being broken apart or falling apart because you came in and, and dealt out where people are not... Um, treating each other fairly, which on the outside can look like, okay, well, maybe you help this person, but really it's from your own inner turmoil that this is being issued. And so it's not as much about the other people as it might seem. And sometimes things get overreacted, over convoluted due to your um, involvement in the situation. And that's where chaos and suit really happens. The situation with Lilith and Libra is that you may not always see where you are the wrongdoer because of the justice dealing. You are clearly seeing the equality or injustice and therefore how are you the one that is wrong, right? So there's more that I want to say. We're going to have to do this in part two because I'm running out of video. So I'll see you in part two.